We're gonna get a fresh piece of chrome. Sure thing! What you after? Construction workers went on strike after finding their tools in the morning covered in blood. This site's a parking lot where gangs have been known to pop up. Gang violence is a maybe, sure, but my money's on a cyber psycho attack. If I'm right, do what you can to incapacitate them. I'll take it from there.
little bit ago, a tiger claw called for help, attacked by a certain Aki. At least that's what they call the rogue tiger hunter. He's been picking off his own in violent but spectacular fashion. My gut says this Aki had a cyber psychotic break, but I'd like to know for sure. Don't kill him if you don't have to, and don't forget to watch your back.
We got to get rid of it. Really? It's pretty massive. V. Nice to see you. Oye, sit. Sit. You want a beer? One mind one. Salud. A lot of time has passed. How you been? Been better, to tell you the truth. What is happening? That night when... When Jackie fell. I should say. Things haven't exactly been easy since. Yo sé cómo te sientes. Todos lo sabemos. I am in the middle of preparing an ofrenda. There is still so much to take care of. Could help you with that. Gracias, mi cielo. But I will manage. It's enough you come to say goodbye. Want to take part in the ceremony, but... Want to do it the right way. In line with tradition. Mm-hmm. But... Something I'd, I'd lay by his casket that would do justice to his memory, I... I don't got anything. But your heart... It's in the right place, mi niña. Don't worry. It's symbolic. Look for something in his garage. His past is all there. Jackie had a garage? He used it for his motorcycle, mostly. But not so long ago he moved in. You'll find something there, I'm sure. Won't mind me digging through his stuff? No, mija. He's gone, and funerals are for the living. Not the dead. Toma. Take the key. Thanks, Mama Wells. Ah, don't mention it, V. You have respect. I admire that. The garage is on Republic. Ahí te veo. Ivy. You here alone? This is not exactly the safest neighborhood in town, Misty. I used to sit on the stairs when I was 10. 26 now. If anything was gonna happen, it wouldn't have taken this long. What are you doing here? Sitting and waiting. And yeah, waiting for him. Though I know he's never coming back. Lately, I've just been coming here to sit. An hour. Sometimes too. I know it's gonk, it's just... I miss him. A lot. Wanna sit? Catch up? Hardly gonk at all. Just... Well, human. I guess. You know each other long? Half our lives. Grew up in the same streets. Saw each other a lot, but... Just never got together. Till you're back. Yeah. Best darn year of my life. Jack talked about you. A lot. Always saying how much you meant to him. Did he really say that? I bet he used different words. <laughs> Maybe, but... That's what he meant. I really believe that. You actually got to know him. The real Jackie. Everybody else thought he was a goofball with a rough-hewn face and an edge. But they're wrong. What did you see in him? Let me tell you what he told me once. Told me he'd take a bullet for me. In an instant. Even if it'd kill him. Spoken like a true Haywood boy. A man. With dreams. Ambitions. Only thing they cost him was his life. There's a huge chunk of his past in there. How come you're outside? I don't have the key. Jackie never gave you a set? You two didn't get that far. He offered, but I wanted him to have his own space. Just his own. 
Mama Wells is having a send-off for Jackie. I need to find something he really cared about. Mind giving me a hand? I'm not sure I should go in there, V. Still too soon. No, it's not that. Mama Wells and I aren't exactly on the best terms. She wouldn't want me touching any of his things, disturbing the memory. That I know. Jackie'd want you here. That's more important. Come on. Wonder what's in there. That's his lair. Slept there. He must have had a different key. Let's look around. Might be tucked away somewhere? Found it. Guess no man cave's complete without some of those, huh? He said they're collectibles. They don't print them anymore. It's definitely why they're up there, yeah. Oh, Jackie. Is that a... a mandala? Mm-hmm. Oh, it's a long story. Hey, you all right? I'm so much better than all right. I once told Jackie he should sweep all the dark energy out of this place. A sand mandala would do the trick, for example. He told me that out of sand he'd build a castle, a home, the Wells family hideout, stronghold, something. I guess you made a bigger impression than you thought. I guess I did. Isn't it just a little janky? It's hideous. But it's also the most beautiful thing I've ever seen. <laughs> Jackie's favorite tequila. Still sealed. It's his lucky charm. One of the first bottles ever made by Jesus de Abajo. The founder of Sensan Tequila. Only a hundred of them left in the world. All owned by the one percent. How did Jackie get this one? Some shriveled abuela in Mexico sold it to him. Told him de Abajo had stolen her recipe. Taking this, yeah. Perfect for Jackie. Well, you got something for your ofrenda, but we could look around a little more. Leather belt? Sort of a memento. His dad's. He used to beat both Jackie and his mom with it. Until one day, Jackie fought back. Kicked his butt. Told him he'd kill him next time. Old man was hospitalized, and then he left. Why did he hold on to it? In case his dad ever comes back.
Better get going. Actually, V, I think I'll stay a while. Say bye to him here. Mama Wells wouldn't want me there anyway. You gotta come, Misty. Got a right to be there. I'd rather not get in Mama Wells' way. It's for family. You were family to him. I guess you're right. Thanks, V. So? Shall we go? You ever thought you might leave Night City? Sure. Once upon a time, I even tried. Seriously? Meaning... Packed my bags and hopped on a plane? To Nepal. Thought I'd stay there. After a week, I realized I couldn't live without the traffic outside my window and my neighbors hollering. know you. My deepest condolences. He was a fine boy. Then go raise a glass to him, Padre. Hey. A few glasses. De acuerdo. V, hey. it's good you're here. We're about to start. Sit down, please. I thank you all for coming today. I'm not going to tell you what kind of man my son was, or lament about how much I miss him. Instead, I'll tell you a story. When he was about 19 years old, Jackie was in the Valentinos. They were at war with Maelstrom back then. I get a call from the hospital. They tell me he got shot three times, just by the heart. He was conscious when I get there. So many tubes coming out of him. He looked like a, like a pulpo, like an octopus or something. He tell me, he said, no te preocupes, mama. Look, I'm bulletproof. Nothing bad will ever happen to me. And when I go, he take off his Valentino's ring. He swear he won't need it anymore. But he was not scared. He just didn't want me to worry. <laughs> Descansa en paz, mi hijo. Among the membership of the Night City Devils Boxing Club, we had this saying, make your best friends among the fighters who knock you out cold. And it's true, Jackie's arm was a cannon. No one's ever hit me as hard. <laughs> I can still almost feel it. Twelve rounds, buddy. Me mandó Camporta. Lamenta no estar aquí. Todavía le quedan cuatro años que cumplir. Me pidió que leyera esto. Recuerdo cuando Jackie se nos unió. Era un niño fuerte. Cuando decía que iba a hacer algo, cumplía. Tenía olor, ol, ol, honor. Podría haber llegado lejos. Mis condolencias a la familia. Que descanse en paz. Anyone else? I, uh... I often think back to the first time me and Jack met. I'd been hired to drive him and some contraband across the border. He'd bought some goods, klept from Arasaka. Top secret. Priceless. A lizard. <laughs> and... 
And I remember what he said then. That, that I came from a place where everyone's family. So, he must be too. Jackie Wells. The best friend you could ask for. Loyal to a fault. Once he set his mind on something, he was ready to die to achieve it. He... He once told me, Chica, the one thing we can't do is be afraid of others. For his loved ones, he'd sacrifice his life. Without hesitation. But most importantly, He loved life and had no fear. Heart on his sleeve, he, he didn't overthink things, he just went for it. Thought he was bulletproof. And that he'd become legend at the afterlife. And ultimately, he did what he set out to do. Shit in the shoes of some powerful people. If he's watching, Bet just about now he's flipping him all the bird. He always wanted more than he got out of life. Rest easy, Chum. I would like to say a toast. Or mi hijo. Thank you for your kind words, V. I'm glad you're here. It was a beautiful offering that we gave him. A lot of people come today. Even that putika Jackie was messing around with. Her name is Misty. What? Misty. She was very important to him. Do you understand? Go. Invite her along for dinner. It's the least she deserves. Do you know what? You're a good woman. Jackie would want you to have these. Thank you. I'll take such good care of it. Cuídate, V. Hey. You all right? Yeah. I think I'm just... Still in that garage, mentally. I just need a sec. Campos all torn Gonna up. Gonna miss him. Says he feels like he lost one there of his own. Do. I wonder if he'll be as torn up after you die. <laughs> Me too, Chica. We'll go start in something. Uh, Not today. Too. Here's to Jackie. Got off to greener pastures. Jackie Wells. Proud son of Haywood. I should mingle, Vic. Sure. See you later, V. Pour you another for Jackito. Pour for Jackie. Amen, sister. Hey, you! Have a drink with us, hmm? To Wells? All right, why not? To Wells! May he rest in peace. Think we might know each other. Gustavo Horta. V. Yeah, I've heard about you. Well, heartfelt condolences, friend. From me, Campo, and all the Valentinos. Thank you. Whoa, whoa, what the hell?
here to say goodbye to one of your own, Padre? I'm here to say goodbye to a good man. I'm gonna move on. Go with God. <laughs> <laughs>